first and never looked back. The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Tennessee Smokies and the Montgomery Biscuits. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Sandy Gaston, the Cuban-born right-hander, will be on the mound to start. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, man, we're getting a look at a guy that's really been struggling lately. In his last three starts, he has a whip of over 1.50. Lots of base runners, lots of hits, and lots of walks. And that doesn't add up to very good performances. So he's going to look to turn things around in this one here today. Batting third, the second baseman. Coming to the plate oh, now, yeah. Javier Baez. Well, yeah. And it's been a big series for him with the right bat. He's collected eight hits already. First pitch coming. Here it is. Oh, what a pitch to start oh, the at bat there. It's nothing in one. Come on, baby. See it driving. Let's go. Just a bit late, and he's fallen behind 0 and 2. Not surprised he's late on a heater right there. Just saw an off speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. Hey, you can do it, kid. No one better up there. Let's go. One Way ball, outside. Right. Yeah. 1 and 2. Hey, that 0 2 fastball wasn't even close, but I'm hit right now. I'm still sitting on that heater. Slow roller down the third baseline, but this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at 1 and 2. Find some green, baby. Find some green. From the belt, kicks and deals. Got him. Fooled on the pitch as he swings at it in the dirt for strike three. Good job to corral this quickly. Stepping up to the plate, Maddox Miles Mastroboni. The left fielder, Miles Mastroboni. On its way, the 0 1 pitch is put Cheers. in play to the right side of the infield. And it's not in he time did. as he's in well ahead of the throw. You know, D Rose, sometimes one of your best friends of your own team. Stepping in, Javier Baez. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, he's got to put. Oh, yeah. oh, and he gets the inning started with a bang as this is hit high and deep to left field. Gone to lead off the inning. A solo shot here to left. Sixth home run on the season for him, and it's now five to three. Well, if I was the manager, I would tell my pitchers to work around this guy. I mean, he's hit three home runs against them in this series. What more do they need to see? Four, five? Jeez, enough is enough. Into the box now, Andres now Diaz. Already the two for two. He'll look to add Andres. on right here. Diaz. Hit out towards second. Scooped up to second for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. So digging in now, Javier Baez. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Baez. First pitch of the at bat. Nope. Outside. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Drives it out to deep right center field. Center fielder on the run. Long run, but he gets there to track this one down and a very nicely recorded out number three. Nothing across here this half of the inning. Home half of the fifth coming up. The Smokies are on top, 5 to 3. Digging in once again, Tristan Gray. Now batting, second baseman. The one two. Gray. It's on the ground out to second. He's got it. And there's out number two. So striding in, Michael Bird. Number two. Michael Bird. 
The one two. Hit back up the middle. And gets through and he'll reach base again on his second base hit of the game. You don't see that too much in today's game. Most guys, it doesn't matter what the count is. They're looking to line them. Drive the ball out. Into the box. Grant K is looking for hit number three here in this at-bat. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. Reined in. On to first, and this will remain a tie ball game as the inning is over. But the tying run comes across here, so it looks like this could be a wire job. We'll look ahead to inning number eight now, and we are all tied five to five. Your Shane McClanahan has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 62, Shane McClanahan. Ready to begin the eighth, and that'll bring Leading in the second the baseman, Javier second Baez. Base. Javier Baez. Hey, come on, big guy, get your pitch. First pitch coming, here it is. And a fastball close, but ultimately ruled a ball, a 1 0. Some action out in the bullpen, couple of right handers starting to loosen up. The 1 0 home is swung on and missed. Strike one. One and one. Oh, big guy. See you driver right here. One and two now. I got the count. One hey, no shame in that. Your eyes light up when that heater comes above the belt. That's so tough to lay off of. High in the air down the right field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. Again, a 1-2. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly. Come on, come on, come on. Throw come on, on to first on. in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Digging in, Javier Baez. And he's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Javier Baez. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Rolled slowly down the third baseline. Hey, I need you right here. Let's go, kid. The 0 1 pitch. Waves and misses no for strike number strikes. two. Big pitch coming up right here. He'd love for a ground ball or a strikeout. Struck him out. And now they'll likely need a base hit to get that runner home from third. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Eight to five tonight. The Tennessee Smokies came through when it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Jordan Minch gets the win in relief, his second of the year. Rob Herman wraps it up for the save, his first of the year. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. For my partners, Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show.